some particular leadership things you do, or is that just you lead by example and they they want to be? I I consider you an attractor of of talent more than a recruiter. Well, well I, I think I think what you do is you surround yourself with winners, mm -hmm. winners or leaders, and then you try to, to we I. One of my best skills, and people say, Ted, you can talk on any level with the, <laughs> with the maintenance guys all the way to the president. Yeah. But my best skill is I, I know how to listen. Yeah. And when my players talk, I listen. When, when people are around me and my administrators are talking, I'm listening. And I'm always trying to make that a, a, an advantage of listening because then you go back and, and you know what, you know, you, you put there, you know, like, like a lot of kids, you know, I've seen coaches, teachers give up on a lot of kids, and I never give up on kids. Uh, I'm 81 for 83 on graduation. 81 for 83 as a head coach, mm -hmm. college coach. And I never had kids in trouble uh, with the no pass, no play. Because we, we were always at Harris that uh, we were going to be academically sound. Mm -hmm. but, but as you go back, you got you to walk in their shoes. 